Hi, my name is Ray Salemi and I'm an application engineer consultant with Mintographics. And today we're going to start talking about using verification in FPGA design. Uh, that's not a popular thing. A lot of folks don't do any real verification with FPGA design. And we're going to look today at reasons why one might want to do it. Uh, and also, we're going to look at uh, how one can get from a, any spot in the uh, sort of verification evolution to the next spot and the next step and move up. But today we're going to look at some of the issues around uh, FPGA design and why companies are starting to move to a space where they're doing simulation and verification before they take their FPGAs to the lab. Uh, just as a background, our experience in Mentographics in the industry is that uh, state-of-the-art FPGA design is that an, an FPGA will come up in the lab in one day in a good situation and a week or so in a bad situation. And so design flows that are going longer than that for an FPGA bring up uh, probably benefit from what we're going to talk about today. Okay, so we're going to look at uh, FPGA debugging. We're going to look at why it's not working anymore to really just go into the lab and do it. And then we're going to look at the steps that you can take to bring your team from wherever they are right now to the next level uh, in FPGA simulation. Uh, we're going to be talking to folks who are either brand new FPGA designers, either students out of school or folks who are just starting up with FPGAs, but also experienced uh, FPGA developers who have done a ton of FPGAs and have brought them to the lab and brought them up successfully, but who may be running into more and more problems with lab time spreading out more and more as the debugging gets more intense. Uh, and also project managers, FPGA bring up issues are a major risk factor in schedules and uh, we're going to talk about how to take that risk out of the end of the schedule, especially to take the risk away from the deadline time when everybody's looking at your product and asking you if it's done yet.